Oh, I got a few emails from folks who want to know what the Trump, le Trump letter is about. And a few other letters, what they were about, too. So anyway, we we'll got Trump. I guess he got my address from... TV interviews. I, this is all pre-internet. I didn't have a computer until about 2002. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. So that's about real estate. Number two. Time to buy real estate now. Guess out this one. This is the one I turned down. A TV show, but I'm not. This is not my world. Do you have what it takes to be my next apprentice? Okay. Uh, I only work with people. Blah blah blah. With goals, go getters. So far, I don't know. I'm not a go getter. Only in other worlds. My team, Trump education, if you think you have what it takes to be my next apprentice, prove it to me. Okay. My team is coming to your area in the next few days to conduct a intro apprenticeship workshop. Um, workshop 125 per person, okay. Attend with your sponsor, a friend, or a business associate you trust. Real estate, okay. I don't think so. Continued on reverse. Okay. Oh, funny. Very funny. Uh, what is it? Now is the perfect time to attend my intro apprenticeship workshop. Don't sit on the sidelines. Oh, interesting, I suppose. Take control of your future and attend our upcoming Trump intro apprentice. Yeah, well, I fill out the other form, too, and I then... No, I don't think so. This had to have been sent to me in the 90s, I think. I don't know. Phone number. I call it that number. Trump Education dot lab dot ca canada uh -huh. well i don't think no i never went to anything that's basically what the donald wanted years ago 
He sent the forms as well, but I don't. That's not my world, sorry. So we'll put them. Oh, I'll put this guy in the box. Okay, we'll put him in the box. I guess he saw one of my shows. I did a lot of shows in the 80s. Oh, 80s and 90s. and Got my first computer in 2001, I think. But another mystery one here. This is. New Westminster, British Columbia, Canada. So I, I got the card too somewhere. They sent two of them. I don't know why that is, but happy anniversary. Okay. Anyway, what else we got? Oh, wow. Uh, NASA. Oh, my hand ready. Bad is it or mine? I'm quit. Under the impression that it is difficult to re yeah, it is very hard to reproduce it. Do I still work with Hathaway or anyone else? I wonder what's this. Let's take a look. Is there a date here? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyway, it's, um, I got lots of these town letters too. Huh, 216 number. Oh well. I think I'm gonna reverse none. No, I'm not gonna put him in the box too. That was years ago, I guess. Oh well, let's see what else we got here. Uh Dr. Kuntz, who may concern right on this video and John Hutchinson. Demonstrated the Hutchinson effect of electrostatic. Non-magnetic levitation, so the Mr. Hutchison has existence of other exotic effects. Something about Soviet Union within the United States, I believe they. Significance to humanity, especially these kinds of. Dr. Coons was a good friend, actually, and he had a stroke some years ago. Sadly, he was a real good friend. He'd phone me up quite often. Sincerely, Dr. Coons. His brother is uh, Coons as well, a writer, I believe. I'll put that in the BOX. Oh, no, something to do on a sunny day, I suppose. This is it's this one. The Air Force Division and uh, John Hutchinson address. Uh, scientists within the laboratory told their, according to their potential value to the Air Force. Okay. Phillips so Laboratory. So they cannot fund it. Oh, um, Sandra L. Arrowwalk. I think I talked to her on the phone or something. Uh, 
by the laboratory, I've been evaluated by the scientists within this laboratory. Okay, well, that's understandable. I'll put him in the box, too. Oh, what else we got here? Mmm, more, what's this one? Oh, uh, the an, an analysis, dear Alexis, I have finally found one or two of the steel sample also enclosed. Basically, the overall samples hard to read it looked like silicon steel page two interesting and the cat is the breakdown Yeah, that's... Silicon, calcium, iron. thousand counts. Hmm. Interesting stuff. Atomic percent is normal size to one hundred. It is no K ratio. K ratio times R. Hmm. Hmm. That was a long time ago. Hmm, okay. Let me do a chart. Yeah, it's pretty detailed. Okay, well that's from Alex Pizarro a long time ago. University of British Columbia. No, BCIT. There's some, some play. Put him in the box too. Oh, grab another paper. Oh, this one. I just ran them. Okay. The West Richard Police Department. To whom it may concern, we Canadian Police Certificate for these application, foreign travel, foreign work permit. Name Hutchison, John Kenneth. Address. 420 9th Street, New Westminster. That's before I got the apartment. Let's see what that Probably says I'm criminally insane, right? No. Joking! This certificate that uh, research this space. Fail to disclose any such persons with with a record of criminal. Certification. Clean record. I was going to immigrate to Germany, so I needed a clean record or a paper stating that on my criminal activities. I kind of moved to. Uh, that's why I had the gun option. I was going to move out, sell everything, and take off and live in Deutschland, but that never happened. Other things happened. Oh, I heard something outside. Anyways, but no criminal records in the databases anyway. Okay. This one. 
Q um, Institute of Technology Ionometric um, Crystal Power Cells. Yeah, he tested the mode. Okay, even took a uh, photograph or um, X-rays of the power cells, which I have on the power unit itself. Big heavy thing. Uh, this one. Mm. Hunting Lane, Hunting Beach, CA. This is from Jack Hoke. And he uh, videotaped the Hutchinson effect a long time ago. He also gave me several books with I have enjoyed. And Close is a book which I personally have gotten to a lot from. I think you will enjoy it. Hope oh, all is going well with your project and I often think of the fun days we had in experimenting with your equipment a couple of years ago. Thanks for keeping in touch, Jack Hauk. When was this? BC six seventy. Wonder when that. Guy, God, nineteen. Look at that, nineteen eighty eight. Wow. Jeez, man, time just goes by. So anyway, free internet. No internet. Not this one. Oh, Berlin University. Okay. Dr. Almond. You were drawing, I hope you were for your letter by about a year. Metal samples were tested there. Written up in Esquire magazine as well. Hmm. written up in Esquire magazine and I believe I think a while to read it and then I guess we'll put them in the box oh letters and this is rolling Oh yeah, Roland arranged all the testing in that year or so. And Roland's, uh, is this page three? I don't know where the other pages are. They're in that other paper pile. I want to tell you that I gave your sample to the... The... What? University of Berlin. Yeah, he did a little thing. He did a lot of testing. And I have the report too, somewhere. As soon as I have a detailed analysis of your samples and uh, this report confirms your effect. So it's no problem anymore. Let's see how it proceeds. I told the people of the University of Berlin 
have to bring uh, Max Planck, okay. God, I should have, uh, I got the, his letter with the report too. Golfy Spocky. Yeah, Roland stayed with Billy Ross and I for a year. Expo, oh yeah, yeah, Expo 86, holy, wow. I gave demonstrations at Expo 86 of the Hutchinson effect. In the dome, I went, there's even TV coverage of that one. John and Billy, wow, with Billy Ross, unbelievable. Billy, John. Yeah, I stayed with Roland in Munich when I went, finally went over to Germany. And then to Peter Kokoschnig, and then... Uh, what? Oktoberfest, oh yeah, yeah. I kind of miss Roland. We're very close friends, and haven't last time I talked to him was, it was 1996, or 2006. We talked 24 hours on the phone. I'm not kidding. Well, Roland, if you ever see my stupid channel and videos, big hugs to you. I hope that we meet someday again. So you keep well. Sorry to hear about your brother and all that horrible stuff that went down. Anyway, a box of paper tells a hell of a story, I guess. She. Uh, this is 22 minutes. Uh, okay. But anyway. Wow. Wow, Roland. You, you used to have email. Even before I did, I got mine in 2001. Wow. Didn't know how to use a computer. I don't know, it's just weird stuff. I need somebody to go through all these papers and make a comprehensive uh, study on it. As a whole, like, I have two of these white containers in the other, see those containers, the garbage containers, I have two containers like that, in, the uh, green, as you can see it, cargo container, that's full of this stuff that I cast aside kind of, and everybody else has too, so. Anyway, I should get going. I got some other crazy things I gotta do. I finished my apparatus and I have to film that too and show it off. So take care, Roland. Dr. Almond, I wonder if he's still alive. And Dr. Pappas. Anyway, shut up, John. You're talking like a nut. Okay, gotta go.